everybody, welcome back by on the road. Let me just do this. And then I'm going to show you a magic trick. Something that happens every time during the winter period. Now, you can't see shit through the window, right? This is what happens when I turn on my windshield wiper. Still can't see shit. Want to know why that is? <laughs> Pay close attention. There you go. Interesting, isn't it? Tons of water on the inside of my car. Great, isn't it? Yeah, I know. It's a lot of it. So, yeah. Prepare to see a lot of this. It's going to happen a lot as well. Now I'm being checked up on the inside for why the hell I'm not going anywhere. It's water. Is it all gone now? That's would be a shame if you can't see shit. Yeah, no, would it? it. Yeah, let's see how it's doing on the outside now. Yeah, that's... It's something, isn't it? Anyway. Uh, again, it's, uh, you know, still not being able to do most of these while well, it's daytime. So, you know, another week has passed since last episode. It's starting to run out, which isn't good. But anyway, you should be able to see a bit clearer now, and if it's any consolation, I'm not seeing much more than you guys are. <clears throat> anyway, let's get going. Nobody wants to run into any issues. What's well, going? I got my windshield heaters on, and I really can't see a lot. God damn, this is this isn't fun, people. It might be fun for you, but it's actually quite dangerous if you think about it a bit. Anyway, I'm still driving, but people are waiting for me. They already left them. Let's see if I can get some more vision going here. In the meantime, right? I mean, it should solve itself in a little while, as you'll probably be able to notice. But for I mean, yeah, it's not the safest thing in the world, is it? Anyway, um, squeegee for the win, right? People keep wondering why do you have a squeegee in your car? Well, you know. Oh, look at that sweet vision. Oh, it's brilliant. It really opens up your eyes, doesn't it? <laughs> uh, anyway, I do got a thing in my car that is supposed to get rid of moist. But, you know, maybe that my car is as leaky as a sieve. But, but I mean, it's, uh, yeah, not really uh, too much as it. I should probably get like 50 more of those, and maybe then I'll get this as dry as the Sahara Desert. For now, we're going to have to do it with this. And the problem with my windshield, front windshield heater system, is that it drains kind of a lot of my battery, which is another reason why the car tends to not really speed up as much. Yeah, I think that's the correct term. Anyway, um, I would say just look at the uh, beautiful autumn scenery, but it's dark as crap when you can't even see that. So, just endure the dark side. Um, which is fitting, because if you look at the time, it's, well, not the time, more the date. It's actually Halloween today, which we don't really celebrate here. And by we don't celebrate it, I mean there's no decorations outside. People, more likely kids, don't go trick or treating. Um, the only thing we do get is uh, TV networks tend to show off uh, horror movies, and that's for Halloween, folks. Yeah, but you know. If it's not something you grew up with, you don't really miss it as much. But for those, well, I would say for those watching this on Halloween, which is impossible, unless you're viewing this in a year, which is odd, but thanks for being here, future people. Um, you know, happy Halloween and stuff, I suppose. Uh, which concludes the entire section that I had planned for this while I still have a good amount of time of driving left. Uh, anyway, 
Looks like Vision has properly returned. Please, I can turn this off. And save some battery power. Hey! Um, anyway. So, if you go... <coughs> Ugh, damn cold. You know, if you think it's through a bit more, considering that my car is letting in moist through everywhere, having water on the inside of your windshield is one thing. Now, considering it's odd, <coughs> stop creeping up on me, cough. Considering it's autumn now, you can probably already tell where I'm going with this. Yeah, it's gonna get winter, and if it then starts freezing, yeah. You might just have ice on the inside of my car. Which is just freaking peachy, isn't it? Well, I don't get over it. The car has survived through it already, so, you know. It's not like it's gonna blow up or anything. It's just gonna be a little while longer before I can finally get this car going. Good times. Good times. Like I said, my car really doesn't like cold temperatures, and here's one more reason for it. It doesn't start as well as I would like, and there's water everywhere. Not just on the... Not just on the outside. But hey, I got my squeegee! That's great. Other than that, I also have a uh, roll of what's that called? Like not a toilet roll, but like two toilet rolls stacked on top of one another. Probably have it somewhere lying here. If I can dig it up. Ah, uh, no. It's on the... No, it's not on the back seat either. What the hell is that? <clears throat> Tish, like tissue paper? Is that it? Is that the word I'm looking for? It's not meant for tissues either, but no. Using your kitchen for spills. If you don't want to use towels. Paper towels, that's it. Hey, paper towels. A roll of paper towels. Holy hell, and still <clears throat> took a while, but hey, the roll of paper towel, that's it. Some things going on here. All right. It's, uh, <laughs> which kind of goes into what I've recently said, but it's a Halloween trip. So yeah, we're not really celebrating here, but it is creeping its way in. So I'm guessing like in five years, Halloween's gonna be in full swing here as well. Whatever companies can do to have you buy crap, right? So yeah, uh, it's probably just a trip to some foresty areas where people jump at you from behind trees and shrubbery. Meh. Yep, there's a skeleton right there. So, yeah, that's the Halloween trip kicking off, apparently. God damn it. Here I go, make an entire statement that we do not celebrate Halloween, and then you got the real world creeping in and messing up everything I just said. Now you make me look like a fool. Thanks, world. Much appreciated. But, um, anyway. I am correct on saying that we don't really celebrate it. You've got the occasional event and stuff like that, but if you take a gander to the outside, you don't really see skeletons hanging all over the place, so... You know. Well, I got these blinging lights here, but those are construction lights. We got a lot of that, though. Got a lot of that. But little to no decorations.
maybe indoors a bit better, but we don't go throwing pumpkins in our front yards or uh, things that creep up on you. So, yeah. <sighs> anyway, uh, once again, the reason is not Sunday drinks, but it's actually Saturday. Also, do not go off from the timestamp you're watching. I still have to set my douche cap to show the correct hour, which is one less hour of what it's currently showing. So it's actually uh, 8.30 rather than 9.30. A lot of people going as ghosts, it seems. I wonder if it's a last minute panic to get a costume ready. Eh? These lights are pretty darn annoying and without purpose. Oh no. What are they doing here? What the? Probably <clears throat> standard procedure checkup for drugs and alcohol, I'm guessing. It's a good thing I noticed that cop wasn't waving at me. Holy butts. Then again, if I would have been stopped, there would have been something interesting for you to watch. And again, for all we know, it could have been the same thing as at the MOT, where they just cover up the camera. Hope you saw that episode, those episodes. Were pretty fun. <clears throat> but yeah, uh, just to check out for DUI, whatever the... Why, maybe... Why? It's an I, not a Y. Whatever the influence may be, drugs, alcohol, steroids. Can you be under the influence of steroids, or is it just something that you just stick into your veins and hoping that everything is going to be all right? Don't know. I don't know. Just got to make sure that I don't run over everybody here. Again, chances are slim, there's going to be a return trip, so when I get to where I need to be, it's going to be over, which is pretty soon. If you remember, I believe it was actually last episode, uh, yes, I think so, then uh, we're going to be there for quite shortly, so let's speed up a bit to get past this bus. Uh, it's going to be pretty short, if you remember me mentioning the... Uh, cocktail bar, that's where we are heading right now. Now watch that entire place be decorated for Halloween, and then I'm looking even more like an idiot, even though you'll never be able to see the insides of it, but, you know, it's just my little proper pumpkin box, which is going to be like, yeah. Anyway, that's going to be it, so thank you guys for watching, hope you're still in the series, appreciate it for coming right now. I'm starting on to see you guys on the next episode. Bye, everyone.